everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be memory planning last week, which was May 14th through the 20th, and I am using my B6 inserts by So Much Crafting. I'm going to be using a kit today by It's Just Paper Co. I've had this for a few months now, and I really wanted to use it in May, and we are finally in May. Um, like in the middle of May. <laughs> I did haul this a few months ago, but um, in case you guys missed that haul, I'm just going to go ahead and flip through the sheets really quickly. Um, so here we have the glitter headers that match the kit. And then here we have the full boxes and some half boxes. This is foiled in silver foil and the quote box says, oh, happy day. And it is just all kinds of pink and I really do love it. I'm so excited. Um, on this page, we have date dots, icons, Monday through Sunday boxes, quarter boxes, habit trackers, and some build dues. Um, here's your functional page. You got some checklists, some um, like script icons, the weekend banners, a little bit of deco, and some more icons. And then on this page, we just have your headers and your littles. Here we have the checklists. You have um, more quarter boxes and half boxes. And then here we have the bottom washi, which is also foiled, date covers, and your washi strips. So yeah, I'm really excited for this. I love using silver, so I'm excited to see how it turns out. So yeah, if you guys want to go ahead and see how this turns out, then just keep watching. Okay, so the first thing that I want to do, as always, is put down my bottom washi. I did already go ahead and white out the corners here of these lines. I'm hoping I didn't have to white out the middle of it, but we will see. I don't think we will because this washi is pretty busy, has a lot of print and stuff. So I am going to turn the planner here so I can go ahead and hopefully lay this down straight because last week I had some issues. And... I'm so excited. So today is Wednesday uh, and I'm like ready and I'm excited for the PVC sale. And I wanna know if you guys are shopping it and if you are, like what shops are you guys checking out? If you guys can let me know down below. Um, I do have like a few shops that I really wanna check out but you know, I don't know every, like I've, I've been on the PVC sale Instagram page. Um, and I've kind of like made a mental list, but I'm gonna go into like more detail of that tomorrow. But I did see like some, what am I doing next? Glitter Headers Day Covers. Um, I did see like some sneak peeks of some shops I wanna check out, Shop Jessica Hearts. It's coming out with a kit and it's really pretty. It's like lemonade theme and I'm so excited. And although Hello Petite Paper isn't in the sale, she has no releases and, um, or she has kits that she reformatted and I wanna pick one up. So I'm really excited for that too. Um, okay, so I'm going to do date covers and glitter headers. The kit did come with date covers that I wish I could use, but they're the strips, like, um, like one piece. And I mean, I could potentially cut this down, but I don't feel like going through all that trouble for that. Um, so I am going to be using these from Rose Color Days. The only thing I don't like using about these in these inserts is that I have to push it down past this line here with the header because it's it's not small enough to fit in just, just this space. So it gives me less room in the box, but it'll be fine, I'll, I'll be okay. As far as the glitter headers, I went back and forth, but I do not think I'm gonna do the pink. I think I'm gonna do like this cream color, like oatmeal, it reminds me of oatmeal. <laughs> That's what I'm going to use. So yeah, I am going to speed you guys up through that part while I lay those down and I will be right back with you.
All right, so this is how that looks. I accidentally put the wrong date covers on, so I had to switch that. I was looking at it and I was like, why doesn't this pink go a little bit better? And then I realized that there were no date dots. And so then I realized that they were the wrong date covers. But I fixed it and I think it looks really pretty. Um, so yeah, I guess I'll zoom you guys in and we can go ahead and get started on Monday. All right, so the first thing that I wanna go ahead and mark is that um, Coffee Monday, that's what I wanna mark. Uh, I was gonna do it behind some washi, but I think I decided to cut up a full box. So I cut some of this box, if it cut, I hope, yeah, it cut through. And I think I'm gonna use this as washi strips because I'm not going to be using all my full boxes in this spread, just making sure it's straight because sometimes even if I use a ruler, it's not straight. <laughs> um, I'm gonna put that here. And I hope, well, you know, I was gonna say, I hope it's not too much pink, but this whole, I'm just gonna have to just accept it now that this whole spread is gonna be too much pink. Um, I'm going to be using these that say Hello Monday by Tasseled Planner. And I'm just gonna go ahead and put that in the middle. And this is in silver foil, put that right there. And if I didn't I like finish saying what I was saying before about the PVC sale, uh, if you guys do have like any shops that you guys are checking out, I would really love to know down below so that I can check them out. Maybe you have some of your favorite shops that are in the PVC sale that I just don't know about. Yeah, just let me know. Um, I think the next thing that I want to do here is mark that I did get happy mail that day. So, okay, so I guess I'll just go ahead and explain this week. So I don't want to use any of these to divide my sections this week. I feel like I'm not using gold at all and there's already a lot of pink going on in the spread. So what I decided to do is make my own washi because this is the washi I pulled for this kit. I just have a lot of pink and silver and there's not enough variation for me. I don't like using my bow washi to divide my sections. I don't know why. This one is too thick. This one's just thin enough but I want pink in there somehow. So, and I wanna break it up. I don't want it to be the same. So what I decided to do is in the kit, she has, oh, right here, the washi strips. And I did what I've been doing in my sidebar, in my Erin Condren. So I'm gonna cut these down once I get to them, but I just laid down these overlays by Rose Colored Days in silver foil. And I just did them on some patterns so that they can be different throughout the spread, but still bring in the pattern and still bring in the silver foil. So I am happy with that. So I think for this section, I'm going to take this one here, and then like you can tell, it's not all the way through, but the washi is, or the overlay is gonna guide me on how much I need to cut off. So, and if it's not perfect, that's fine. That is okay. So I'm gonna cut some of this off. And then I'm gonna place it down in the middle to divide my section and I'm going to mark that I got Happy Meal that day. Um, another thing I wanted to talk to you guys about was, usually these are, <laughs> I mean they're memory spuds, but I mean a lot of it is like basically the same thing that I've been marking in my Erin Condren, um, except for like a few things here and there. So I wanted to know I, I don't know why I feel weird asking. I think that looks really pretty. I hope it's not. I feel like I laid it down crooked, like the sticker itself isn't crooked. Um, I wanted to know if you guys have any questions you guys want me to answer sometimes while I'm doing this. I know a lot of people do that. And at first I was like, I'm not gonna ask that because I don't think anyone has questions for me. Like I legit don't feel like I'm that important. I still don't feel like I'm that important. I'm gonna do this upside down um, to have questions. But if you guys do have any questions, I really don't mind answering them because I'm essentially sometimes planning the same things over and over. I just do this because it's fun. I don't really need a memory spread, but I enjoy laying down the stickers in a different format than what I do in my Erin Condren, so this is just something I enjoy doing. I do like looking back at it too, but you know what I mean? Um, it's not like anything new, like any new plans. I mean, sometimes there is, sometimes there's not, so yeah. If you guys have any questions, just leave them down below, and I would be happy to answer them when I, whenever I do these spreads, like next week when I film. Um, okay, so Happy Mail. What did I want to mark that? Oh, yeah. I think I'm gonna take a quarter box. I do wanna bring in this like taupe color. Not this color, not this brown one, but this one I do wanna bring in. 
Um, I want a quarter box, and I think maybe I will bring that in. Maybe I'll do it in the whited out box then. Where is it? Right here. And I'll put it on this side. Yeah. Because it's essentially just two colors. I'm, well, two main colors I'm bringing in is this taupe color and then 50 shades of pink. So, you know, I don't have many options. To mark Happy Mail, I am going to be using these little envelopes by Fox and Pip. And I'm going to put it on this side, and that is to mark getting Happy Mail that day. And then, as usual, as my Mondays go, I did work on orders that day. I think I'm going to take, let's do a dark pink. She has these half boxes here. So, let's go ahead and center this half box right here. I can tell you guys right now that I have been enjoying... Uh, a little bit more white space than what I usually enjoy. I don't think I'll ever go full white. I'm not gonna say never. I don't see myself going full white space. I don't like writing on the paper. I like writing on sticker paper. I don't know, I feel like it makes my handwriting look better. I don't know, but I have been enjoying a little bit more than I usually do. To mark my orders as usual, I'm going to be using these bows by Tasseled Planner. I do have a coupon code for her shop. And I'll go ahead and link that down below. I'm going to save these because I'm going to use these again. And I'm going to be using pink. And I'm going to put that right in the middle. And that is to mark orders. I feel like I had something else to talk to you guys about. <clears throat> like something happened. And I was like, oh, I need to talk to uh, you guys on YouTube. <laughs> I don't know what to call you guys. Okay, I'm going to put two full boxes in the middle. I really want to use this quote um, only because it's a quote and I have, I don't know, I've had this thing for white full boxes. I feel like, I don't know, but uh, that's just what I want to use here. Okay, that's not peeling back up. That's so pretty. So here's where it gets hard. Okay, so I eliminated these because one, I could use it as washi. Two, I have it in this big strip. I love the macarons, but you guys, I really like the door too. Um, I might use the macarons down here, it depends. Or one of these, I mean, I have a lot. So right now though, I'm going to use the door for Wednesday. And I'm gonna put that right there. Perfect. Okay, I don't think I'm gonna do anything to divide my sections here. I'm just gonna lay the quarter boxes down there. And the quarter boxes I'm going to be using are foiled ones by Tasseled Planner. Um, they're one of my favorite quarter boxes and I like having foil in the middle here. It, like in Tuesday and Wednesday. I'm just trying to see what shade I wanna use so that is definitely out of the picture. See, I thought this brown shade would look good but nope. All right, I think it's gonna be gray and pink. Okay, let's do a light gray here. Should I leave the white space? Yeah, I'm gonna do it today. I'm gonna do it. Oh, I kind of ruined that box too. I'm going to, oh, that's what I wanted to tell you guys. You guys, it's been bothering me this whole time. This whole time I was like, what was it? I wanted to talk about, or was that in my Erin Condren? Yeah, I plan out conversations. That's how bad it is. I think it was in my air. Oh, whatever. Since I brought it up now, I'm gonna bring. I'm gonna talk about it. Um, I was gonna bring it up in my plan with me this week whenever I film it because it's gonna be June first. But I am excited for summer because uh, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. Summer isn't really like my favorite um, season. If you were to ask me, it'll be fall winter like the beginning of winter then after Christmas and New Year's it like it dies down but um I just like summer because I get to go to the beach that's basically it I don't like the heat the humidity I don't like any of that but um let me see what did I have to mark oh y'all that I went to Starbucks that's about as eventful as my life was on Tuesday um I don't know if I want to use that I have so many options here I feel like I do want to use this, but I, this the cup is big, so we're going to eliminate that. I do want to use these by Artbox stickers. I've been dying to use these, but I feel like the other ones will match a little bit better. 
these from Hello Petite Paper. Ooh, even this one, because, you know, I get my, it's not a Frappuccino, but I get a, um, what do you guys think? Should I put it on this side? Or should I do the white cup? I'm going to have to check the white cup. Um, beach, that's what I was talking about, right? I really don't know. Uh, I think I'm gonna go do it. Okay. I don't even know what just came out of my mouth, but I think what I was trying to say is I'm going to do this cup. Okay, so sorry you guys, I get way off track sometimes. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. Hmm, I think this week I'm gonna. Sorry, I'm pre planning like my stickers. Um, I'm gonna do it on this side of this week. There we go. Okay. Wednesday, I do want to mark that my daughter had her concert uh, for chorus. If you guys have been watching me, you know that I mark that she has chorus every Thursday after school. And on that Wednesday, she had her concert. To mark that, I'm going to be using one of these hearts by Clever Gal Crafts. This is in her Stella, Stella colorway, and it's in silver foil. Back to what I was trying to say. Um, maybe I want to do it, yeah. Summer. I like... Uh, the beach. Okay, so then talking about the beach, right? That got me thinking of um, what else happens in summer that I really love is Shark Week. I love Shark Week. I'm kind of obsessed with the ocean a little bit, a lot. Um, I don't. I I I I know how to swim, but I don't go in deep water. Um, I panic internally and externally if my feet can't touch the ground. But I do have like this um, love for the ocean, like just curiosity, you know what I mean? And so every year, even though like most of the shows are rerun, I'm excited for Shark Week, which then made me start thinking. I saw a preview for a movie, which is called The Meg, and I'm a sucker for shark movies no matter how cheesy they are. Ooh, you guys. Okay, so I'm going to put that quarter box to put that my sister-in-law came over and I'm gonna use, whoa, you guys can't even see. I'm gonna use this car from Love for Stickers. I don't think the shop, or I know the shop isn't open anymore. Um, the Meg is a new shark movie that's coming out this summer, which it looks kind of cheesy, but you guys, I'm, I'm all about it because, okay, if this goes here, that icon goes there and this, okay. And so, I'm excited to see that. And that started me, me wow. Then I started thinking that what other movies are coming out this summer that you guys are excited to see. Um, I really do wanna know because my husband and I, we love watching movies. Um, I'm really excited for that movie to come out. I'm excited for, um, what else did I do that day? I did clean that day. I'm excited for, ooh, there's a lot of pink. So maybe I'll do that down there. Maybe I'll do a divider here. You guys, what's that movie? Transylvania 3. I love Transylvania, and that's something that we can watch with our daughters, so we're excited for that to come out. As I think I'm gonna use the macarons one. I am gonna have to cut it down just a little bit. But what I'm most excited for to come out is Jurassic World. I don't know about you guys, but there's something about Jurassic Park, like the whole franchise. When I go to um, Islands of Adventure, I love going through that part of the, the theme park. I don't know what it is. Since I was little, I love Jurassic Park movies. It's the only movie that up to this day, if it is on, no matter which part, one, two, three, the new one, I will watch it from the beginning to end. So I'm really excited for that to come out. So do you guys have any movies that you guys are excited to come out as well? I'm feeling really chatty today. Um. Okay, so here I do want to mark what? Or I don't want to do it in that. I'm gonna do it in another quarter box. I feel like these, there's like these little bugs that are attracted to my lights and they won't leave me alone. Um, so right here, what I'm going to mark is that I did do some cleaning that day and I kinda, and this is where I get stuck like when I use such a limited color. There's only so many ways I can go with it. I'd wanna use a half box down here that's this color. So I'm trying to avoid that. And I'm trying to find a shade, light it up. Because so, I could have used the gray, but I 
don't. Hmm. I mean, I'm going to have to use another pink. I have no other choice. But I feel like that's a lot of pink. I wish the box could be like a little bit different. Maybe a washi strip. Let's see what she has. I mean, she does have this, but it's basically the same box I used up there. I could cut this checklist, though. I could. What do I have to... Okay, that's an option. Hold on. I could use this washi strip, but it's basically the same color as what it, what's going on up here. Like the, these pinks. I feel like the checklist at least is a little bit more lighter. If that makes sense, the pink is. So I think I'm going to try that at least. Because I don't want to do gray because I'm going to do gray down here. So I'm going to cut this. I'm going to cut two hearts. And I am going to use this as a quarter box. Um, I'm going to put it like this. And then to mark a cleaning, I'm going to use these icons by Clevergal Crafts. This is also in the Stella colorway and in silver foil. Maybe we'll take the biggest one here that she, oh, will this fit? Like cover the hearts, not fit, it will fit. Does she have any flags in the kit that we can cover some of that with? Huh, I don't see any flags at all. Um, okay. Maybe a different icon. That's definitely not big enough. Did I pull anything else? No. We could do the vacuum. How, how is there, I'm going to make my own flag. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to cover these hearts up just so you just can't see them at all like that. And then I'm going to layer this on top of it. And we're gonna call it a day. And there we go. Okay, so there's that. And then I do wanna put a, I don't even think I'll need a to-do header. I don't think there's really room. Um, I wanted to put this half box. I hope I don't regret it. What did I do? Is this Thursday? So I did work on order, so it's gonna look, okay, it's gonna look exactly like that. So I'm not going to put, uh, whatchamacallit a to-do header. I'm just going to go ahead and put that there and then I'm going to take one of these bows again by Tassel to Planner, put that right in the middle and that'll be for that. Okay, get rid of this to-do header here. So for Friday, Friday I did some shopping on Etsy. Um, let's do that in a half box. I was just in, let's do it in the light pink half box. Oh no, I do have another one of those. Oh good. Okay, I'll do this. What else do I have to mark? Um, okay, yeah, I'll do this in this half box here. Oops. And then to mark that, I did pull these from Hello Petite Paper, these little cell phones, and I'm going to use that here on this side to mark that I did that. Okay, then maybe a today header here. The one that I just, oh, it's to do. See, I don't wanna use today because it's that gold color. Um, there's little things, but I don't, I'm gonna have to pull today headers because I wanna use some today headers, just not that color. Or maybe, let me see what else she has here. Um, what, what am I marking here? Sometimes I don't even know. So Friday, this light bug is really bothering me. Friday, okay, so we ordered takeout. So I wanna, we, we like ordered takeout and then we had a movie night. So I want to mark that. Mm, whatever, I'm just gonna go ahead and do another divider. I'm going to do Let's do this pink. It's like the smallest. I can make more though. Yeah, I can make more. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and put that here. 
it's so pretty. I'm going to put a quarter box. Maybe I'll do a foiled one from Castle Container. I even forgot already what we ordered. Like, why is this over here? All my quarter boxes are on this side. I think I might do a gray one again. Yeah, I'm gonna do a gray one. And I'm gonna put that right over here. Okay, so mark that we had that. I have these from Tass not Tassel Planner, Rose Color Days. And they're just like little meal icons with the fork and the knife. I'm gonna put that there. Really cute. And that'll be for that. Okay, then we had movie night. That I'm gonna put behind some washi. I have these here from Hello Petite Paper. I am going to order more. Uh, Cause I like the scripts, but these up here say movie date and these are just popcorns, but I like these a lot and I wanna get them in her glossy paper. Yeah, I'm gonna put that down here. Do I need washi though? I feel like I'm changing right before your eyes. Nah, yeah, I can't, I can't do it. I need washi. Um, I can do silver and white or I can do this. I've been, I don't have many chances to use this washi so that's the one I'm going to use. And yeah, that's what I'm going to use. I think I'm going to double up on it, should I? I do, I wanna double up on it. The movie we end up watching was intense. It was Red Sparrow with Jennifer Lawrence in it. Yeah, that was like different, very different. If you guys have seen it, you know what I'm talking about. You know, what else did we watch? Oh, we watched, um, you guys, we really like watching movies in this house. If this doesn't look good later, I'm not gonna layer it, but I'm just, I just wanna try it. We watched uh, Ready Player One. I actually really like that movie. So that was fun. And I'm gonna go ahead and cut it from this side. Hopefully it doesn't mess up this hot box. No, it doesn't. Okay. Oh, you guys, there's like just like a tiny bit of washi left. So I'm gonna use this, which yes, this is a eyebrow razor. Um, I don't like using slice tools and I haven't bought or gotten around to buying them. I'm sorry, I don't like using X-Acto knives and I haven't gotten around to buying a slice tool. I'm gonna put this movie knife sticker here and see how I like it. Um, I think, okay, it's okay. Yeah, I, I can do that, okay. So for Saturday, Saturday I did sleep in. I think I'm gonna put that in a quarter box that I slept in. Or maybe a washi strip. Let's do this washi strip here. And I did have these from Lovely Plannery. I didn't know, oh no, this goes good. I usually when I use these, I layer it with, okay, I'm getting all confused over here. I layered it, or I layer it with a heart from Tasseled Planner, like one of these. And maybe I'll do that this time. I don't know because there's a heart right here. So I don't want, even though they're like not right next to each other. I don't know. I'm weird like that. So let's see how I like it. I want to position it a little bit better. Right here. And pick this up. Maybe I should do it with my tweezers. And position, oops. Position it a little bit. But I want it like here. Let's see how I like that. Honestly, I think I'm just gonna do the pillow. I just don't want I feel like this heart is this heart here is so big. I don't want two hearts like that close to each other. I don't know. It's really weird, but I am going to do the pillow. I wonder if the undo is still on there. 
yeah. So I'm gonna pull this up gently. I did pull up some of the washi strip, but I will be fine. And I'm just gonna put, go ahead and put this right here in the middle to mark a sleeping in. Okay, then I did go get my nails done that day. So I'm gonna put a to-do header. Where are my headers at? Right here. What else did I do that day? I filmed my plane with me because I ended up watching movies all night and I wasn't, oh, so I'll do to-do for filming. I'll do a divider here for this section. Let's go ahead and do this one, which I feel like I put this down crooked, the overlay. So let's try and fix that here. Yeah, I think that's fine now. And I'm gonna mark my, or get my nails done. So I realized, I don't even know how, oh, I think I was watching TV and a commercial came on for it. I think I'm gonna use a foiled box. I kinda wanna use gray. Or let's use one of these boxes because I haven't used one down here. Yeah, let's use it over here. Yeah. Um, I was watching TV and a commercial came on, but I don't know if you guys have ever watched the show 90 Day Fiance. I don't watch a lot of TV, period. And when I do watch TV, it's not a lot of reality TV. I don't know. I, I guess I just kind of grew out of it. I, I don't know how to explain it. But 90 Day Fiance is my guilty pleasure. I'm going to use these by Tasseled Planner. I kind of want to use a pink, but I'm eyeing this gray right now. I'm going to do the gray. Um, and uh, my husband either. My husband... Most of the... Okay, this bug, really. Most of the time, if you guys see like a random bug flying around here, I'm so sorry. <laughs> but it's attracted to my lights. Um, so for like reference, some kinds of shows that I used to watch um, are, let's see. Well, they're not really reality TV shows. Oh, to do header. Um, well, some. Keeping Up with the Kardashians. I loved that show. Um, Teen Mom. I was obsessed with Teen Mom. But my husband complained so much that I ended up just like recording them. And then I would forget about that I recorded them because I literally have no time to sit down and watch TV sometimes. And then I would get so, so now I'm like so behind that I don't even try to keep up anymore. Uh, every once in a while, I'll tune in to Keeping Up With The Kardashians if it's like a big episode, like when Chloe announced she was pregnant and stuff like that. But anyways... But 90 Day Fiance though, me and my husband are both on board. I'm gonna use my tweezers for this because I'm gonna center this camera in the middle. These are from Tasseled, no, I'm so sorry. Lovely Plannery, I hate confusing shops. I don't know, I feel like that's disrespectful. So I'm so sorry. But that's from Lovely Plannery. It is in silver, silver foil, wow. And I do also have a coupon code for her shop as well. If you guys wanna pick these up because these are adorable. I'll link that down below. Anyways, me and my husband are on board. So if you guys watch 90 Day Fiance, there's like 90 Day Fiance, 90 Day Fiance, Happily Ever After. That's what's on. So it's like past couples from the show. You guys, it's intense. We watched it on Monday. We recorded it. It comes on on Sunday. So here I want to mark that I did upload. So I'm going to do that in one of these from Tasseled Planner. Um, we watched that on Monday. It was a two-hour season premiere, which I love, and it was intense. So if you guys do watch it, I'm telling you guys to comment so many things, but really comment that one down below because I would like to talk to you guys and see how you guys feel about it. Because, like, Nicole, if you guys know who I'm talking about, you, with Asan, you know, from Morocco, she's on there again. And just other couples that I liked or want to keep up with okay so I marked that for my upload um, I did work on orders that day most of the day and then I while I work on orders I don't know if any other people do this but I like do I want to do pink yeah let's do pink here let's do this dark pink um, while I work on orders let's do to yeah let's do to do header um, I prop up my phone on, um, 
on my desk and I watch Plan With Me's. Um, Sundays are my favorite days to do that because I, mostly everyone uploads on Sundays. So I'm going to mark that as well. But I have like a little YouTube bench, which makes it fun to watch other people plan and talk and, you know. I feel like it makes me work a little bit faster, like I'm more... Um, I'm more concentrated, or I'm concentrating more on what I'm doing. Um, I call it the groove. <laughs> Sometimes it's hard for me to get into the groove of just like packing orders, making the bows and stuff. And Sundays though is easier for me because most everyone I watch upload on Sundays though. So this is what I was afraid of. Okay, I'm going, I don't need these two. Well, I might need one of them, but I don't. I don't need two of them. I don't want to use this. Ooh, you know what? Nah, I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to go through all that. But I am going to move... You guys can't even see. I am going to move this overlay, which I'm scared to do. I don't know if you can. And I was watching... Oh, I can do it with this. But I was watching Viv from Viv Loves to Plan. She put one one of these overlays, but on a full box, and she tried to pull it up, and she was having a really hard time. So I was scared I wouldn't be able to do that. I'm gonna put it on this washi strip because it seems to be like the perfect size. And if it overlaps a little bit, it's okay because these are clear, so you can't even really tell. Okay, so I'm gonna put that divider there, and then I'm gonna mark having that YouTube bench. I am going to use a quarter box from the kit. Oh no. Mm. No, because that's like a whole bunch of like pinks. Oh, yeah, yeah. And these two, you know what we're going to do it. It's two shades of gray, so. I'm going to go ahead and put that there, and then there's like, it's fine. Yeah, it's fine. I'm not even going to look at it that much because then it's going to bother me. I'm going to put this pink laptop these are by tassel planner and these are so cute so i'm gonna go ahead and put these here and that's it for the pre or pre-planning back planning i'm gonna go ahead and move on here so she does have hmm. okay here i'm gonna do the last glitter header i had to think about that a little bit um, I'm going to use the last glitter header up here, which is where, in the glitter header sheet, and I don't even know where that is. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and put the last glitter header here, the last oatmeal colored one, <laughs> and I feel like I wanted to say something, I forgot what. Um, okay, so she has these two Monday through Sunday boxes, I'm not going to use either one of those. I am just going to use one of these checklists. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to white out the days of the week here because they might show through right here. Oh, I was going to tell you guys too. Um, so I don't know if you guys remember, if you guys watched my like last haul, like the previous one. I... <laughs> I hold Simply Gilda washi. It was her, I think it was her anniversary washi, but this time she did it with, um, what you want to call it? This bug. With rose gold um, foiling, if you guys know what I'm talking about. And it's the floral one, if I didn't say that already. I am going to use this Simply Gilda washi. I think this was in her Valentine's Day release. It has like white hearts in it you you guys can hardly tell but it's there uh or no maybe i'll use it on the bottom maybe i'll use okay so anyways while i was hauling that i was saying that that washi would look nice if it was in like a light gold foiling instead of rose gold because i feel like i i loved that washi but i use um gold more than rose gold so you know i would want to use it more well, she just sneak peeks today, and I don't think I think in like one of her releases in June, she's releasing that washi with gold foil. I was so excited. So then, so I I was excited for that. But then when she I think she did another sneak for her subscription box, 
in her like subscription box page on Instagram. So not on her regular Instagram. But um, I remember doing a plan with me. You know what? It was a B-sex plan with me. A few weeks ago. And I said it would be really pretty if she had a light blue and gold washi. And somebody did message me or comment and say that she already had one. It was, oh my God, why can't I think about the name right now? It was some kind of blue. And I, I can't think of the name right now. Anyways, and I was like, I don't even know how I missed that washi, to be quite honest with you. Um, but she's coming out with that in the June subscription box. So by that time, I'm pretty much convinced that whatever I speak into existence, the washi's gonna come. Two, three, four. So I think I'm just gonna keep naming washies that I would like, and those would come like to be because that's basically what's going on right now. So if you guys have any washi requests, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but that's how I felt though. Can we have more lilac washi? Particularly like the little spotted one that I like to use, lilac. Or like a lilac and gold, like um, the washi that kind of looks like that that's spoiled, that would be nice. Okay, so I went ahead and left four circles because I only track four habits here. And here I'm gonna put an extra full box Usually I wipe this part out and I skip over it and I have time to think and I totally talk through that whole part. Um, to be quite honest, I'm kind of feeling one of these boxes that are foiled. But I feel like that's right there, you know what I mean? That would have been really pretty here. And then the door down here. What do you guys think? I feel like, oh yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna switch these two boxes out. All right, so I did the switch. I really like how that looks. I feel like this is just far apart enough that it doesn't bother me. Um, so I think here, what I want to do is, hmm, does she have a this week? She has a reminders, but it's kind of like the same color as this boxy. Oh, they're both are, but there's more. Okay, I'm just gonna do it to do up here. I'm gonna go ahead and put this upside down. I am going to white out this daily tasks section and put this to do header here for those habits. Okay, down here I do wanna put the washi strip. I have like one more left. I think I wanna change it to one of these. Do I? Yeah, I do. I like this print a little bit better than just the plain pink, so. That's a good thing about undo, is that you can change your mind. I went to go get some more of these overlays, but for some reason I think her shop is closed. So, of course, like when I fell in love with them and I want more, it's not available. But I have to pick some up, some more up, because I haven't used them in like a whole spread yet. Um, but I like using them like this so far, so. And I like how you can turn any washi or washi strips in a kit into like washi of your own to use it like I do, to layer even. Okay. You guys can't see it, but a little bit of that, or you guys can, is showing. I don't like that at all. Mm, perfect. So let's try that again. Okay, hopefully I left a half box. Okay, good, I did. Just a whole bunch of paint going on, right? Yeah, I don't think there's, no, I used the other one. That's fine. I'm going to put this here. I am going to have to wipe these out because it's showing the box is really curved. Okay. Go ahead and put this box down here. I'm trying, it's so hard for me to lay down curve boxes straight. I, I really don't know why. Okay. 
I think that turned out really good actually. Um, okay. Definitely washi from the kit. Some of this. I need to print maybe this, these macarons. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut it and I'm going to put this washi here from Simply Gilded. This is just regular pink and silver. I am gonna flip you guys upside down real quick so I can center this. Let me put the washi down first before I cut that. So that's already off, so I should have used this cutter. It's a little bit too big for me. I'm gonna cut the washi. I want more print than the washi. So I'm going to go ahead, cut this off here. And I'm going to cut it from the bottom so I just have a little bit more space. Hopefully that's straight. I can never pick it up. I usually skip you guys over all this. I can never pick it up so I always have to use my tweezers. And even then I struggle. Okay. Um, I think it looks good enough. It's a little bit crooked, but it's okay. Put these macarons here. Oh, I love how that looks. So in the kit, I usually like to put deco around here. Oh, but she has these hearts right up here. But she has like a little bit of deco. It's just really big. Let's put this macaron down here and then let's put a gray heart from Tassel Planner up here. Yeah, and then I'll go ahead and write my thought for the week. Okay, so let me go ahead and zoom you guys out. Wow, I love this. I think this is so pretty. I say this about every kit when I edit my videos. I'm like, I say that all the time, but I really love this. I. And then again, I don't pick kits that I don't really love, so. But I love how it all came together. I especially like the um, overlays. I think it adds just a little bit of something throughout the spread, so I think that's really pretty. What I'm going to, to do now is I am going to fill this out. I'm going to be using my tool pen like I usually use. This was gifted to me by um, like a follower on Instagram. And I think she got this from... Was it like a staples or something like that? Anyways, my point is, is I tried to find this on Amazon. I couldn't find this specific, specific one. I don't know if it was a limited edition, but if you, if you guys know where I can get this, please let me know. I don't want to drive to like all the office supply stores before I find it. But if, I mean, I'll do it if I have to. I don't know how much ink is left, but uh, if you guys could help though, that would be awesome. Anyways, I am going to go ahead and fill this out and I will be right back. All right, so this is what it looks like all filled in. I really do love it. I love the silver with the pink. I just think that combination is really pretty. Um, I did go ahead and add the heart dashes to my half boxes. I like adding those. Um, I did add a bow. This is from my shop, and then this is just one I made for myself. As usual, all the shops that I mentioned today, I'm gonna go ahead and link those down below. I really hope you guys enjoyed watching me plan this week. If you did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.